Hey, it's Poppin' to Squad. I'm back with another video to make our life better. So today, today, today. Y'all ask for it again. So we giving it to y'all. Okay, will you give me something to drink, please? What's yours? What's uh, what's in there? Juice? Mm -hmm. Thank get, her, you. get rid of the orange juice. Don't open the brand new one because okay. she, we need to get rid of the orange juice. So, y'all ask for it. Y'all request it. We got y'all. You hear me? Impossible Whopper, guys. <laughs> Let's get into it. So, how's everybody doing? Oh, Lord, you the Lord. I'm doing, man. I'm doing. It's 4th of July. How? Y'all go see this late, though. Y'all go see this, like, in August. No, no, no. You'll see it before then. Like, the week before August. No. This ranch is... I keep hot. telling her to do it more than just on Tuesdays. Maybe if I keep hounding her and getting her getting on her, maybe she'll listen. Maybe. Thank you so much. I got her some Chinese food that she needs to do a month thing on, but you know. We're gonna go next today. Mom, no, this is some this I don't drink some No, it's not. It's regular orange juice and the strawberry orange juice Mom. together. I know it's something to you were drinking that last thing with, with, with liquor. Yeah. I drink anything with liquor. Yeah. You were drinking. I bet I was. <laughs> let me see that. Um, let me see that. Uh, ke uh, ketchup. This ranch don't taste good. Maybe my taste is good. But that wasn't last night, Uncle Indy. Well, not night before last. That was a couple nights ago. Oh, they actually gave me a tomato. By the way, the person that was in my last muck thing. Cause I said he was a homeless man. He's not really homeless, you guys. He's just one of my friends like I've had for a while. I've known him for like five years. Who did it with you? Kevin. Oh. Okay, here we go. You don't want onion or pickle on yours, do you? No. Okay, well I'm gonna cut your cut your. They're supposed to give me a whopper. They gave me this shit. I know it has mustard on it. It's a whopper. I don't even eat that. I don't think Whoppers have mustard. Whopper Junior. Oh, maybe they don't. Yeah, I didn't think so. Ooh, these onions stink. Y'all know I don't eat nothing on my sandwich. Okay, here's your bite. We're gonna don't bite it yet though, because we're gonna do it together. Okay. So yeah, we got the Impossible Whopper. Cause somebody try it. said that it was good. Somebody commented said it was good. Wait, can I look at her? Look. It looks real. Wait, it looks cute. It needs a little bit of more sauce on it. Don't smell it. Just smell take it. a bite. Ready? Come on. I gotta put some ketchup on it. Okay. Ready? It don't taste bad, but it mm. don't taste like a Whopper. You know? It's got its own taste. Yeah. But it's not bad. But well, it's own distinctive taste. Right. But it's not nasty. Right. It's, eat it's edible. Right. <laughs> it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be, honestly. What's on it? It's an impossible it's a burger. Fake. It's patty, it's not meat, it's vegetable. Oh, really? Impossible, it's an impossible whopper. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> right? No. Um, my husband's mom is calling me. Can you see that? Oh, yeah. She loves me so much. I'm gonna call you back, mom. Can I just take my medicine? How does your chicken have a tomato though? Mine doesn't. So I took it off here and put it on there. This was supposed to have extra tomato too. Mm-hmm. Unless he got it. I might have gave him the wrong one. Sorry. I need a ketchup. Okay, so I was trying to get my Uncle Andy on the camera because I know y'all would love him. But he was lame. I'm lame. He won't get on he's the camera. He's a double L loser. Yeah. He won't even let you take a picture. No 
let alone be on camera. So, Kita, I know I, for I forgot to finish um, the last Burger King mukbang. Mom, story about the drag queen. The drag queens or whatever. It was my birthday. I went to a bar. It's a gay bar downtown. And we went there for like three days. Me, Janelle, Sugar Mama, whatever. We went there for a couple days in a row. First day, they had a drag queen show. It was somebody dressed up like Michael Jackson. They was doing the damn thing. You know, look. Um, I went to get a drink, like a shot. And when I did, I moved the chair because I'm a big bitch. I can't sit in every chair and be comfortable. You know I mean? I'm not going to sit in where I don't feel comfortable. So I just moved the chair out the way. And when I did, like, one of the other chairs fell over. And then this drag queen that, like, stopped with everything that he was doing. It was like, dang, you need to go home. Look at you. Today. You're drunk. I hadn't even drank nothing yet. Like, just automatically be mean to me. Like, then I used to have, like, gay, like, gay friends at school and stuff. They used to just be like cool at first then they would start being rude to me and being mean to me like calling me fat and stuff like I, I just I have that experience with gay guys like gay men have always just been so fucking like rude to me I don't know then went to the drag queen show and the dude and I even told the, the, the drag queen I was like it's my birthday you gonna be rude to me on my birthday I'm not even drunk then he felt bad he got me a drink like boy and then um, what else happened? Pop Lock and Drop It came on. Because they don't just play, you know, that, you know, what you would think is in a gay bar, you know? They pay, they play other stuff. So we got up there with Pop Lock and Dropping and shit, and then he want to make fun of me because I'm fat. I'm not making fun of you because you're wearing makeup. The same guy? No different one. Mm -hmm. Gay guys and bars are like that, though. They really are. They're rude. They really are, seriously. They really are. But I have a gay guy friend. His name is David. He's my husband. He's my gay husband. Like, we're madly in love. And when we go out together and stuff, I would tell you about, you know, that's my husband. I'm his wife, you know? Yeah. Gay guys and bars, though, they're like that. They really are. Mm hmm. If some of them just be thinking they shit don't speak, but it's like, I'm not, I'm accepting you. How are you going to be rude to me? You know? Right. I really would have been cool with just this chicken sandwich. Sorry. Without this fake ass Whopper. I hate fake. It's just a junior. It just don't taste like, you know, Whopper has like a taste to it. You know? Like a Whopper taste. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this got a burger taste. So what you make tomorrow? My little mom in the building. Say what's up. Say what's up. Hi guys. Sure Hi guys. Okay, see. We ain't talking much today. What's going on? I don't know. I'm thinking about stuff. But, um. Me too, girl. Me too. I gotta go to Hy-Vee. Debating if I need to. Missions, I believe. Eat yeah, Ivy's up and see what time I get in the baby. Ooh, she's at the car. I hope something's wrong. <sighs> you know, when you say you accept people and everything that comes with them. When you start getting stressed out, when start, stuff start coming with them. Mm. <laughs> Definitely me right now. Definitely me right now. At this point, I'm just going to be single for the rest of my life. Me too, because fuck these niggas. Fuck all y'all. I can never find a real one, so. Me either. They all just get on my nerves. Literally, my mom, I said something about somebody the other night. 
I was like, cause he pissed me off. He get on my fucking nerves. She said, Chase, you said every man can tell your nerves cause they do. <laughs> but no, Chase, all of them. I said, cause there's something wrong with all of them. They all get on my motherfucking nerves. Mm. Mm. Not all of them, but every, everyone. So, you know, today is Willie's birthday, right? Mm-hmm. It's Lyric's birthday, too, so I'll lyric. Um, well, Courtney posted. Which well, I ain't. Don't, they be watching my listen, stuff. Listen, I, I ain't. People in them. Okay, but listen. Um, I'm not saying nothing bad. I'm oh, just okay. saying I'm just shocked that I've seen her post because I haven't been seeing them. Oh. Mm-hmm. And I looked at the pictures that she, um, she posted, and mm -hmm. I can't believe how old he looks. He does look old, because I've seen Tyler post some shit. Because he isn't that old, but he looks old as hell. Yeah. He, he is old as hell, though. No, he's not, that, he's not that much older than me. He's like 10 years older than you. Girl, he's not that old. He, he looks older than what he is, is what I'm saying. He looks really old, and I was really shocked. Mm -hmm. I wasn't. This is gross. I just complain. Every time I eat food, I complain. I'm sorry, y'all. Because nothing tastes as good as my own cooking. And the juice is nasty. I don't drink so many deep. Y'all, so it's my birthday. My birthday. No, it ain't. No, <laughs> it's my homegirl birthday. <laughs> Look, I'll be thinking every day my birthday, don't I? It's my homegirl birthday coming up. Shout out my prison pal, her name Diana. And she lives like two and a half hours away from me. And um, Saturday is her birthday, July 9th, 8th. So, or actually her birthday's on July 9th, but July 8th is when I'm going out there. I'm gonna go to the club, Des Moines, Iowa, you feel me? Turn up. I just want to go to prison with her on Sunday so she can visit her baby daddy. And I could visit my future husband, but I don't know how well that's going to work out because I don't know if I'm single or in a relationship right now or not. Mom, we're toxic, okay? Mm -hmm. What's wrong? I got her burn bad. I was really messing up my belly. I'm a toxic person, and I always deal with toxic people. I don't know why. I always have bad luck like you. Girl. Sometimes you just be overreacting on shit. What do I overreact on? Sometimes you just overreact sometimes. Like with him? Or just speaking in general? In general. Because he be saying the same thing. He say, that's my problem. I just you be blowing up. You do, sometimes. I'm not gonna lie. I don't believe y'all. Okay. I, you know what? I ain't gonna lie. I do. But now after I get down, I'm like, damn, I should have thought about it. Maybe I should approach things differently. You know, I'll go in and gonna lie to you, ask him. And sometimes you do you blow up on, on shit, sometimes you shouldn't be blowing up on. I just gotta think of how to approach them. Yeah? People when I feel mad. Instead of feeling bad and discussing that everybody else was something. But I can't. I can't even. I, it's good. Okay, and do I blow up? But I'm just full. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do try I to force be, myself to eat this um, Like blowing up for no reason? You hurt my feelings today. <laughs> really bad. Yeah, she just blew up on her uncle in okay, the vlog. Okay, You're lying. No, you told me that when you went in the store to get I, your vape. I almost had tears. Why? Seriously. He's, I was yes. never. First of all, I'm she's an Aquarius. never. That really hurt Aquarius, my feelings, Marcy. Okay? I am an Aquarius. She's never you know talked that, to okay? me like that. Yeah, I hurt that hurt my feelings so bad. I'm sorry. Yeah, it really, I was just irritated. Yeah, but don't she sometimes blow up on people when she shouldn't? She never. Really, does I have that a good me. heart. I'm, no, doing I'm talking good. about in general on people yeah, sometimes. Yeah, but she, she overreacts sometimes. Because she knows how my feelings are. Like I'm an Aquarius, and I get. She knows I get my feelings hurt. She bad. thinks I'm, I when I tell her that, she thinks I'm just picking on her. But now. I almost cried. I seriously, I was like. This. Now you know. I didn't even do nothing. Oh, yeah. You, and then you think <laughs> well, I'm it up. I told you to get out of my car. <laughs> Are you serious? Your you mom knows how upset I get. Don't be picking on me. <laughs> no, she was mean. She was mean. <laughs> no, I feel bad. I'm sorry. Okay. But 
I know. Really, she she was, was hot outside. I had no nicotine. She was mean enough that we were I in Gavinport. No and we live in Moline. Okay, so we gotta go across the bridge. She would have had a long walk. But I told her to get the hell out of my car and walk. And she was gonna talk to people like that. That's how bad it was. All I said was I wasn't talking to you. No, it's the way you said it. And no, think you kept it up. Right. Yes, you did. I what? Then you kept it up even more. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. I literally said I wasn't talking to you. They're like, I can say whatever I want to say. That's what you said. Because the way you... And I, I said, well, you, you can keep your two cents because I don't need it. Take it back. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Well, you hurt my feelings. Because you know I'm an Aquarius. But I didn't mean Dude. to hurt your feelings, Uncle Andy. You know I love you more than any other person in the world besides <laughs> myself and the Lord Jesus. And my husband. My future husband. And my mom. No, it's mom was last, right, guys? <laughs> mom! I do everything and anything for my kids, but you notice I was last, for right? Our kids is that for me. Uh, okay, so how'd you, how'd you get everything in your house? Everything? Yeah, how'd Most you get everything stuff? in your house? You do for me. I'm not going to say you don't, but you treat me like I'm in the redheaded stepchild. No, I, you, you just never want me around. That's a motherfucking lie. You just like to be I'm around gracious. other people. Oh, I'm still hungry. I'm hungry. I just want to bite. I haven't eaten in 12 days. No, because, and then you never, you always act like you don't want me here. No, it's not just that. Like, always. No. Even Devin didn't want to come here because he said your mom doesn't want you there. Don't go over there. I said, she wants to deal with it. Well, I, we can't cook here. My sink is closed. No, she picks the wrong time. She wants to come at freaking late at night. That wasn't late at night. That was in the afternoon, like 11 a.m. when I not the Not when you came and cooked the first time. Them tacos. That was in the middle, no. in the middle of the night, so don't go there. But she wants to uh, be quiet. She wants to come in the middle of the night. She wants to come when she's been drinking. I don't like to be around people when they're drinking because they don't act Her right. own personal, yeah. They don't act right, and I had to go through some shit with somebody that didn't know how to handle their liquor, and I don't deal with that shit no more. I don't care who they are. And then she wants to stay the night on the nights that, um, like, maintenance or housing's coming. Well, people will be right here. And I don't want a well, lot of people right at, the, at the same time being here. Everybody else can stay not here. I told your sister to go too. Is that what she said? Hmm? That's not what she said. Because I even was like, Mom said, yeah, she tried. Didn't I? Last night when she said, Don't let me out. <laughs> and I Braxton said, was here. Can I finish talking? <coughs> didn't I say, We're going to bed. We got things to do in the morning. We're not staying up. We're just supposed she to said, stay. Oh, well, I'll find somewhere else to go. I was gonna wake up there on my couch or in my bed. I've done that before and went to sleep, but she was sleeping so, right in my bed. I'm not letting, I don't care what she says. I do everything for my kids that I can. But I'm not letting nobody put, get me put out of my house, okay? If you wanted them gone, and you know, I'm not gonna argue with you again about this. But she's been having an issue lately because she's been getting jealous. It kind of makes me feel a little bit loved by her, though. I don't go like, if my mom never gets jealous over me. See, 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 what I, see what I put up with? I said if you're making me feel loved. Yeah, what do you say behind it? I mean, you got jealous. That what I wouldn't hang out with my, man friend, uh, my family, my man's family. You got these people thinking that I, I don't fucking love my own fucking child. Mom, they know you love me, just barely. Uh, so what you just said about getting jealous. See, she wants to be included. Like that right there. And you, it hurt your mom's feelings. We need your therapy. Birthday. That's your, just what we need. Your your mom was. She was so upset. She didn't give me a time. She was only upset because she knew I was with my man people. I didn't have to give you a time. You said you're going swimming. You didn't have going swimming and going here and going there. So I figured I will stay home. I will cook. And by the time y'all get in swimming, we left the pool two hours early. Then this, the food would be done. Your cake would be so done. That just shows that your mom loves you. It really does. Like you, you eat differently at times. I only do that because she, she, she. I do know she loves me. I know she does. Yes. But she just doesn't love me as much as the others. That's where I'd be upset. But it's because of stuff I put her through when I was younger. But I'm not the same person anymore. I'm not a child anymore. My mom still looks at me like I'm a kid when I'm a, an, an adult. An adult. She's always going to think like that, though. That's just how parents are. You really are. No matter how you still look at me like I'm a kid? I'm always a kid. You do? Yeah, you know? <laughs> 
I mean, seriously, you know, like it, it you know. You just see me when, cause when I was a kid. Yeah, I mean. I used to be so cute. Now I'm ugly. Oh whatever. I am. And I got this fat ass scar on my face. My face isn't sym symmetrical. My boyfriend calls me ugly all the time. I'm playing. He doesn't. I was gonna say what. Anyway, thank you guys so much. Y'all know we dysfunctional. So, you know what? Get us on Dr. Phil. Take us. Tell, okay, tell well, Dr. Wait, Phil. Pause. We need to go on Okay, there. so somebody commented for me to try the Impossible Whopper, right? No, they just said it was good because you asked or, was it good. They commented that it was good. So, I tried it. It was good. Excuse me. But I still, ain't, my channel, I still ain't got this no comments. Well, my channel. <laughs> I still ain't got no comments on if I should try my own video. And which should I be? What should I do? So, so she she wants to listen. She wants to start her own channel, but she wants to do either ASMR or she or, wants to do regular mukbangs. But she's or not sure a cooking show, or a cooking channel to show you but things that I cook and how. Y'all know what's crazy? When I first started YouTube, right? My mom thought I was crazy, and I started eating on camera because I didn't start doing mukbangs. I was doing music reaction videos and stuff like that. But I wasn't getting any views. And I was like, let me try this. So I tried a mukbang one time. She's like, Chase, you're going to sit there and eat on camera. What is wrong with you? Then I asked her to be in one one time. <laughs> like two years after yeah. I started. I wouldn't do it for like a long time. And then we finally, I was like, meet my mom. We in our, You know what our first uh, video was together? What we were eating? Mm -mm. Popeyes. We were eating Popeyes. Was it Popeyes? Yeah, mm -hmm. it was Popeyes. In Davenport. Yeah. And I put a thing over your face and I was like, special guest mm -hmm. or some shit. Now, ever since then, she just be running shit. Like... Hi guys, <laughs> welcome to our channel. <laughs> Today we have the Impossible Whopper. No, I'm like, all right, but you done? Yeah. Thing. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video. Thanks again for watching. Love you guys so much. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.